always enjoyed printmaking. As soon as I took my first class, it's just something that clicked with me. I liked the fact that it was a craft and an art. There was the aspect of creating a printing plate and the inking and all that. It was just a nice combination. My work changed somewhat when I moved to the country. The fact of being surrounded by trees and nature really had an impact that changed my subject matter and it changed my techniques too somewhat. of a relief printing, I guess is what it is. It's either wood block or lino cut or mono print combined with lino cut. So I develop a plate, a printing plate, and then I ink it and either print it by hand or print it on an etching press. And I look for wood that has a grain, interesting grain. Some subject matters uh, seem to call out for for the wood block. Um, this, the texture, I try to keep the texture of the wood showing in the print. I print it by hand so I don't lose the texture of the wood. With too much pressure, I can just carefully print it so it looks like wood. Some of the chicken prints and the bird prints are done on wood blocks. And you can see, you can see that it's wood. Sometimes I see something that strikes me that I, I want to capture. You know, it just, I'll see it and I went, I'll just think, I, I want to, you know, make a print of that. That's, that, that's something. Sometimes it's something in my head that I think of. Sometimes it's something that I read and I get a mental image. There's lots of different ways to, you know, get your inspiration for your, your work. what keeps me going it's it's uh, I guess it's just an inner creative urge that's just always there